What's up? I'm JT. This is Ty Ty from Famous Last Words. We're going to tell you some of our tour stories. So, this is probably, this, this is the craziest tour story I've ever had. Because it just, it was mind-blowing. Mind-blowingly shitty. <laughs> so, we were touring in a minivan and a tr with a 5x8 trailer. We were in Philadelphia. No, not Philadelphia. We were somewhere in Pennsylvania. Pittsburgh. And it was, yeah, it was right outside Pittsburgh. We stopped at a friend's house dropped the trailer, went to the liquor store for five minutes, come back, and there's like one or two cops. Two. Two cops. Two, two cops. And they were just looking at our trailer, and they were like inspecting, like finding the, trying to find the, the VIN number and shit. And apparently our VIN number didn't match the whatever it was registered to, so they impounded our trailer. They were nice enough to let us haul all of our shit out and put it in a tiny little apartment that's a little bit bigger than this trailer right here. <laughs> About, you know, about a little bit bigger than ours. And you, I guess you didn't see it earlier, but it's packed to the top. So, all of our stuff's in there. The next day, I went to court. I had to talk to a judge. And I waited until the end of the day. He must have had a really bad case right before me because he was pissed. And he just goes like, yeah, no, fuck you. He didn't say fuck you, but still, fuck you. You can't take your trailer back, you little shit. He didn't say that either, but, you know, you know. He was a dick. So <laughs> your parents own the trailer. Yeah, your you parents own the trailer. They have to they come, have get, to it. come like, down and get it. I was like, shit. I was like, he's like, so do you want to pay this money for something? And I was like, no. Let me call my parents real quick and figure this out. He's like, you can't call your parents. You're an adult. You're, you're I was an like, adult. you just said you I can't get the it? trailer unless I have them. Whoa. <laughs> so that was horrible. I ended up having to get a lawyer two days later to actually get the trailer back. So Got which it was our friend. It was our friend's dad. So that was lucky. But anyways, after that, I went back to our friend's house, and I get a call from my family at home, and they go, hey, we have to put your dog down. I was like, fuck! Fuck! That was, that was, that's the worst. That's that was the craziest the story. I just, yeah. Like, how it lined it up like that is, I don't know, but it did. I'm still here. The dog's gone. But we got our trailer back. This is a new one. So, fuck that trailer. Anyways, Tyler's got a, probably a, a more fun story <laughs> <laughs> for you. So, on a tour with bands, I won't say, for their own protection, <laughs> we decided to go bar hopping one night. It was the second to last day of tour. We decided to go bar hopping. But we didn't have much time after the show to go bar hopping. So, we did what we could. Went to some really shitty bars with some crazy like raves going on we did as much drinking as we could and we realized we wanted to you know step some it up more stuff yeah step it up a notch so like let's get a cab go to a strip club we were in somewhere in arkansas on a tuesday or wednesday if you know anything about strip clubs or arkansas <laughs> or arkansas <laughs> You know, that's not a good day to go to strip clubs, <laughs> so we get in, and the door guy goes, hey, you have to have sleeves. Like, I got a full sleeve right here, <laughs> bitch. There's three people with us that didn't have, like, actual t-shirt sleeves, because for some reason you have to have sleeves on On a Tuesday night in Arkansas at a strip club. Just t You have to have sleeves on your t-shirt to go to a the strip club so we're like oh, okay we can't get in you don't want to offend the so we went the to a sex shop <laughs> <laughs> a block down the road and we were like just hanging out like you know just kind of letting the night go where it goes and the person working there was like hey if you like this sex shop on Facebook you get a free t-shirt <laughs> so we liked the page and got Seductions t-shirts. We now have sleeves. They now so, have <laughs> We went there, got our t-shirts, went back to the strip club with our sleeves now. The people who were sand sleeves. And it was a good night.